where does the friend come in? What what can someone do that perhaps feels a bit nervous to engage someone in yeah, the conversation? Great question because um, it's such important work and, you know, um, it's such a big issue that we have with suicide, um, whether it's related to anxiety or about anything that people struggle with in life. Mm. As a friend, I think it's really important to start a conversation so if there's if you've noticed that um, someone in your life isn't tracking very well and you, you have a concern to sit down and have a talk about it, mm. whether it's in person, whether it's in over text, whether it's on the phone, whatever it is that you think the other is going to be willing to engage in. But to name it. Yeah. You know, I've noticed that you haven't been going so great. I guess something's been playing on my mind and mm. I've been wondering if you've been thinking about suicide as an example. Yes. Actually naming it. Yeah. Because then we get a yes or a no. Yeah. You know, um, and then we can talk about what, what it is that's got them to that point. That's, mm. um, and sometimes this part is missing in conversations. We go straight to freaking out and going, oh, well, let's work out how, how we can keep you safe from those thoughts. That's really scary. And that's all well and good, but yeah. we actually just sit, need to sit down and talk about why. Why is it that you're feeling so bad? Mm. What is it that's got you to this point? I love that. And, and it, it may even help the sufferer uh, try to untangle the web of thoughts themselves because yeah. they may not even know. Just like, like oh, everything. wow, someone's noticed me. That's I'm, right. And pulled back into the world. 100% because often when someone's in that low point, they might be feeling really alone, really isolated, and perhaps like no one's actually noticed. And yeah. all of a sudden, whether it's your mate, whether it's a stranger down the street says... Are you all right? Like, so I'm a bit worried about you. You seem a bit off. I've noticed this and that about you. Are you are you thinking about suicide? That in itself speaks volumes to someone who might feel like no one's noticed up until now. Mm. Um, and that we're quick to go to planning how to protect. But it's actually about sitting in the story yep. and talking about it. Just like with everything else, when you have an opportunity to say something that maybe has been going around and around in your head, sometimes that can take out the... The heaviness, yep. the you know, all those old proverbs, a problem shared is a problem half yeah. and all that. Like <laughs> there's true. actually a lot of truth in yeah. them. You know? and, and this conversation about suicide is no different to any other yes. any other problem that we face. Mm. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. And you know what's something really cool you said before as well? Um, naming it, you know, there's if you look at like any horror movie, they always say name the demon because it gives you yeah. power over it. Yeah. I feel right. it's like a really cool analogy yeah. of like anxiety almost. Yeah. You 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 you're uh, you're bringing yourself to the attention of a problem. You're like, oh, wow, I 100%. actually have to deal with this now. But yeah. when you see it, it's kind of like, it's not this big scary thing that you're not looking at anymore. Yeah, and, and it's also hard if you're someone who's worried about someone and you haven't named it, you're likely to actually walk away from a discussion with them still incredibly worried. Yeah. And maybe you've tried to talk about where they're at, but it hasn't quite gotten to the point that about suicide which is what you were thinking about and maybe they're not actually going to bring it up if you don't for mm. lots of reasons you know i mean there's a good chance that maybe they've tried before and it hasn't gone very well or people have just not picked up on those cues at all and it can be scary to pour your heart out to that level and tell someone that you're thinking about suicide if you're not sure that they're actually willing to have that kind of conversation